Hey YouTube, what's up? Today I'm bringing in a brand new video. Uh, just recently I was asked a question on how to turn on free write missing information on Windows Media Player. Uh, this person, XM92 Agula, I believe that's how you pronounce it, uh, is having troubles with it popping up as unknown artist in Windows Media Player. Well, I know the error for this problem and today we're going to resolve that. So simply find your music file which shows up as unknown. Uh, but first actually, we're going to open up Windows Media, Media Player to show the problem. So actually my Media Player probably needs to update. And... Okay, so to turn off the auto rewrite, what you're going to want to do is hit alternate. Actually, you don't want to hit alter alternate. You're going to want to go under organize and hit options. Right here, you will see automatic media information update for files. Uh, you do not want this to be checked if you want it off. And then you, if you want on, check it and you can select options from there. Uh, and that's pretty much it you guys and now uh, when it shows up as unknown in here let's see unknown should show so like there's all these unknown albums and artists and whatnot pretty much it's in the properties of your file as you can see here this one, if I right click and go to properties, it has details. And it has the artist right there, Fort Minor. If I go to this one, and I realize this one doesn't have any of this. And if it doesn't have the contribu contributing artist, it will show up in the unknown. And same with the album, it will show up in the unknown album. And years, it doesn't really show up in any unknown. Same with numbers. Now, you do want numbers on your songs, just like in case if you want to rip it to a device or burn it to a CD, especially when burning to a CD. Uh, but yeah, pretty much if you don't want it showing up in any unknown categories, then yeah, definitely fill these in. I just pretty much made a copy of that and named it Fault, so this one. Uh, I erased it manually. And one more thing, you guys. If a reason why you don't like uh, the auto update file information thing or whatever that button is, is because it adds more contributing artists. Like if it adds Snoop Dogg or something automatically and it puts it up in a whole different category, I can totally understand that because I don't like it either. That's why I had mine off. So yeah, it definitely does, I don't like it, but it's great to turn on before burning to a disk. So that way you can update the certain files that you want and you can manually have it update certain files. And that you can do by, I believe you just right click and update album info. And it'll update it for you and see, there you go. And you can do the same with pretty much all of this. And yeah, that's the end of this tutorial. I really hope, hope I helped many of you. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.